a good one. And so I had this theory that they weren't coming all the way to the spring. <clears throat> or past the spring into my food plot, but just over to the spring. So I started setting up my cameras on the other side. And I got a picture of Dollar Menu. He walked by my hang on stand, 10 yards broadside. Even I can make that shot. So I'm pretty excited about it. Put some dough urine up in that tree. I'm hoping that it'll get comfortable smelling that and keep coming back. I put it up there high enough you can't mess with it. And then one of my cameras is right there. And there's my tree stand. That's how close he walked by. Another nice thing is that's a ridge down behind me. So if he tries to go around me, I might be high enough in the air that he can't scent me and then if you look close enough you can see my other tree stand right there probably like 50 to probably a good 75 yards away on the other side of the spring and there's turnips planted just through that opening right there that you can see they're only like maybe 20 yards at the most you just can't quite see them. And my cameras have all been another 10 yards beyond that. So I had this theory he was just stepping over the spring and eating there and going back. And I saw a nice print in the spring. Let's see if I can show you that. You can see all the tracks going through. Like there, 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 there. Um, and this looks pretty dry right now. It might have dried up for the most part, but this is what I saw this morning. That's a big print. It's got the dew claws in the back. We've had a terrible drought, but you can see they're ripping up my turnips even though they're not fully ripe. I do have something for them to eat. There, there, and there. They're running all the way up through. I have one patch that's like a hundred yards from my stand. That's pretty decent. Now the wind today <clears throat> would be all wrong. But I bought that. Uh, the wind today would be all wrong. It's kind of been swirling around a little bit. But I bought that climbing tree stand. So I'm pretty excited about that. Because I got plenty of trees I could set up on. On the other side of the trail. For just like a day like today. I honestly... I'm worried about the wind in general here because of the ridge side, but we'll have to see. You can see one of those decent deer walked up through here. This could be this could be uh, Brutus. that doesn't look like it's as big of a track but that toes spread apart pretty well and you can see right here I got a nice turnip patch my tree stand is up in behind this island up in here so I have does and fawns showing up every day there's one doe with two fawns And I get her just about every day on camera. And then there's 
a doe with one fawn that I see every so often. And then there's two does running alone. One of them might be Elliot. The spike with one antler. It's hard to say because that antler's barely poking out. I didn't see Brutus this time, but I have my camera set up in a different spot. So I'm not that worried about that. And then I really think dollar menu is different than four for four. Man, I sure hope so. My dad's excited too. He's finally talking about hunting up here with me. So, so we'll see. So if you like this video, be sure to subscribe and click the bell for notifications.